final days of actually being in New Zealand. We don't have too long before we actually head home next week. So today we are on our way to the Bay of Islands and we are really glad to have just fit in this particular destination because we weren't really sure whether we were going to be able to fit it in on our itinerary, whether it was going to be too fast paced, but it seems in the end that we were able to. Uh, the unfortunate thing was when we went to go and see Mount Taranaki the other day uh, near New Plymouth, we didn't get to see it at all because it was shrouded in cloud and fog and you, we were literally probably a few kilometers from the base of it just driving past and you couldn't even see it from there. So that was really disappointing because that was one of the areas that I was looking forward to most and to photograph so I am super disappointed that we didn't get to go there which is such a shame but next time and I think we did get to see it actually from the plane technically so I mean we did we did kind of see it we just didn't see it from the ground <laughs> so yeah today we have gone from Auckland and we are driving up to the Bay of Islands I think it's called Fengarai. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it, um, but it is near the Bay of Islands. So we will actually be driving there technically tomorrow um, to see, but it's actually been a really beautiful drive so far. The water, the color of the water here is insane. Um, so pretty. We got to drive straight through Auckland as well. So I actually got the feeling driving through Auckland just from the exterior, it's like Sydney's little cousin. It was crazy how similar certain aspects of it were and it really felt like I was back in Sydney <laughs> in a lot of ways it's set out in a very similar way by the looks of it but we haven't actually gotten into the city of Auckland yet like into the centre so we really want to do that in the next few days because we will be driving back probably later tomorrow sometime and when we do that we will hopefully uh, be able to explore the city a bit more when we drop off the van uh, on our last full day we should be able to walk around a bit more and take in the sights then so Anyway guys, we will keep you updated on our drive and hopefully this weather clears up a little bit more because the rain is just like really annoying at times. Even though it looks like blue sky in the background there, it's been raining like all morning on and off. We'll keep you guys updated. Hey guys, so change of plans. We are actually going to Paia. Paia? I'm going to insert that into this video so you guys can actually see the town that we're going to. It's close to the Bay of Islands. We were actually going to go there tomorrow instead and stay at Fungaroi tonight. We're not going to stay there tonight because uh, it was just traffic wise, something was going on. I think there was like a police operation going on and the traffic was insane. It took us so long to actually get out of the town. It, it was so crazy. Um, but we actually found a really good deal with one of the uh, campsites up north and we were going to spend money on a campsite I think tomorrow night anyway down in Auckland which would have been more expensive and this deal was really good so we just decided to do this and then we'll go for a few nights at a free campsite outside of Auckland and then have a shower finally when we get to our next hotel which would be great that was a bit TMI but like yeah you know how it is when you're camping so yeah we're on our way now to the next place and it's sort of like still very up and down with the weather today it hasn't been great although we did get a glimpse of the coastline and it was really really beautiful i wish we had been able to take some footage it wasn't really on my side of the car but um it doesn't matter i'm sure we'll get some beautiful footage tomorrow hopefully we'll keep you guys updated as we keep going along tonight and let you guys know how the campsite is as well good morning and welcome to the next day we arrived at our holiday park last night around 6, I think. We came to our holiday park, the Bay of Islands Holiday Park. It's a really beautiful holiday park, probably one of our favourite ones so far, actually. Great facilities, very clean. It's kind of in this bushy area. There's a lot of trees around. It's very green. It's very beautiful. I'm just going to show you quickly from, uh, from our car the view that we have. It's not really a view, but it's just a really nice, nicely laid out holiday park. beautiful green place as you can see in the footage. Today we're going to head into Pai Paiaia and we're just going to look at the Bay of Islands and have a walk around and yeah it's it's apparently a really beautiful area it looks really beautiful 
and I think it's quite a popular tourist spot so it should be quite a nice day the weather is looking sunny and cloudy at the same time which is kind of annoying as long as it doesn't rain and it doesn't get too windy which it has been quite windy in the last uh, 24 hours or so um, but hopefully it's a good day and we take a lot of great photos and some great video and we kind of enjoy one of the last days we have in New Zealand before we head back to uh, Sydney. guys and we are back in the van now so this is actually our last night in the van in the spaceships van so we're actually it's it's kind of like a bittersweet moment although I think after six weeks and camping in the same van pretty much it's time to move on <laughs> um, we've had a really really good time in the van and it's given us pretty much all the basics that we've needed um, it was a very long uh, time to be in such an enclosed space so I think we did pretty well overall um, I also think that Dan is looking at putting out a blog article potentially on a review of the whole uh, van and how we went with certain things potentially on the North and South Island um, and if you guys are interested in seeing that if you are looking at doing your own trip around New Zealand this is a very affordable way to do so so we could definitely look at doing a review for the van that we traveled in. Um, so we're going to probably continue on vlogging tomorrow when we hand the van back and the next day when we actually fly home. So this isn't the end just yet, but we'll be pretty much just walking around Auckland tomorrow, I'd say. Um, just having a look around the city centre. We didn't do too much today because it was really terrible weather again. So we just kind of like walked around um, parts of Auckland and it was quite a relaxed shopping so we'll talk to you guys tomorrow anyway and keep you updated with how we are going in Auckland and good night and see you tomorrow